David Shoebridge, I'm the convener of the Greens New South Wales and I'll be the MC tonight. Uh, Lee, uh, thank you for your commitment. Thank you for putting your hand up. Thank you for the potential you bring into this campaign and I can't wait to see you being Senator Lee Rhiannon. I've not been exactly lazy, I've been travelling around the world, been over to one of my favourite places. <laughs> New York City. <laughs> Visiting some of my favourite old haunts. <laughs> Which is a wonderful venue called Scores Nightclub. <laughs> Honestly, there was a dancer there who taught me a lesson maybe I should have learned some months ago. <laughs> Polls do matter. <laughs> you can see why Lee will be an asset in Canberra. I'm sorry about uh, the Parliament in Sydney, but she'll hit the ground running because she knows what we're up against and she doesn't have a reverse gear. <laughs> and I've got to say a great thrill of my time was when about 300 farmers from the Liverpool Plains near Gunnedah, the Upper Hunter, and from the Gloucester area bus down to Sydney to stand on Macquarie Street to protest in support of a Greens bill to ban mining on prime agricultural land. <laughs> and that, that, that culminated, we came together after so many meetings in coal affected communities and these communities are really doing it tough. Hi, how are you going? Hi Mark, how are you? Have you had a good night tonight? Yeah, it was fantastic. Yeah, what was your and highlight? Yeah. Inspiring was Lee's speech. She totally pumped up the crowd. Yeah, so you'll be voting for Lee in the election? Vote one, Greens. No. Oh, Tim Hub was fantastic. I think seeing Bob tonight, he was in great form, told some great stories and he really pulled everybody together for the campaign. And are you feeling optimistic about the campaign? Yeah, I think, I think Lee's going to go really well. I think we're going to have a senator back in New South Wales. Yeah. Lee Rhiannon is one of the few people I've known, and I've worked with her for the last 15 years, one of the few people I know who will never be bullied, who will never be swayed by secular interests, who will always stand up for the payload. We probably have about six weeks to go to the election. That's six weeks to make sure that we rescue Australia, we rescue New South Wales, and we get Lee Rhiannon into the Senate. Thanks, John.